put a picture phone call Arabo and asked him hey mbona watu wanasema hivi what you have to say bro nataka tukujua nini Now welcome to entertainment channel I go by the name of Jemomore kama kawaida if you're new here please subscribe to my channel by the way if you're watching this and you just subscribe tafadhali end up watching and subscribe to my channel and you can also like my videos Yes, now today we're going to talk about the hot topic of the day that is the beef between Jalango Nadia Mukami and Arrow Boy now, Nadia Mokami has finally come out to respond to the rumors that she's expecting a first child together with Arrow Boy. So Nadia Jalango revealed it yesterday. Alafu Arrow Boy came on Instagram basically to, to express his displeasure with what Jalango did because I think while going to attack it to a secret, maybe now na ball maybe it may for a few weeks. Maybe no wonder they didn't want the exposure because it's too early. So Arrow Boy generally and on his Instagram, akambia watu wache achekelele basically alikuwa anambia Jalango anaropokoa sana so Jalango ina yeye akaenda aka respond to what Arab boy had said by basically saying yeye ataendelea ataendelea tu kuropoka kama ni kuropokwa to Nadia and uh, Arab boy mm. kama alikuwa nimeropoka mm. eh mm. nitaropoka tu tena <laughs> and that made Nadia Mukami to go on Instagram and actually address the whole situation and... making this video to address Jalango because i don't want to write long on my insta story just say it once and for all so you can read my lips <laughs> yeah. i'm trying to be a sober respectful i've never made a, a video addressing anyone this is my first time and my last one i'll never do it but <sighs> what you did i don't care how rude your follow-up video was was low demeaning disrespectful period okay so you invited us to your home number one i was sick i didn't even want to go okay so our boy was like ah, babe ita ita kavaya to invite you kwa mtu home kwake kwa privacy yake na hakuna kitu tunafanya alafu tukose kuenda wewe jikakamua tuende so i was like ah okay fine let's go I, I don't know, I was 50-50. Yani, uh, me, my instinct. Ata na kumuka ni chalewesha, kila mtu. My instincts to zika kuanga tu. Very right. So, we go there. <coughs> no matter the situation, eh? If you've invited me, I think that means that you you trust me enough that me, I never even knew you had kids. To be honest. Imagine if I went and took a photo with your kids, then posted it online because you've never posted because that's your private space, and I respect your private space, okay? And I remember your kids are smart, beautiful, and stuff. I would have taken a photo and posted me like, ah, but then I made Nani's kids, but I didn't do that because I'm in the limelight. I know when someone chooses not to have a certain thing of theirs not put out there they have their own reasons they're protecting some some sort of their peace so i need to respect that you know ha. fast forward you said what you said and you're not sorry about it arab boy everyone knows arab is the least and problematic person that's wrong with him he's not dramatic at least I know he's not dramatic. He's never had scandals. He's never had drama. So if you see him responding to someone, it's because they've touched a, 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 a live wire that they shouldn't touch. And yes, you have your people coming through for you, gassing you up. At this point, it's Jalango 10, that in Arab boy 1. 1 because it's Jalango versus Arab. So I'm on Team Arrow, so it's 1. All right. People are gassing you up. But I don't care how many people gas you up, whatever you did was wrong. It was just outright wrong. Just, that was wrong, to be honest. If it was a blogger or someone, <laughs> and a promoter, or a, a, like a fan, I wouldn't even care. But you invite to your personal space, 
so that you can open your mouth then the least the, the next thing that follows is you're trying to justify it and say you're not sorry you should ask yourself Arabo doesn't pick fights but he's offended me I'm offended but me if I ever meet you I'm gonna tell you my peace of mind one on one we've been through a lot we have our own reasons as to why we keep our things to ourselves we have our angel ah, I don't wanna, in heaven so you should have picked your I, I, I don't wanna mm -mm. you should have picked your phone call Arrow boy and asked him hey I'm born out on of my baby what you have to say bro not that good you are because you never know why people do certain things especially if you if it's fans I mean people have been talking people have been insulting and um we don't care we don't because this is tunajua the nigga lost his safari and lost his dad last year. Two people in a year. So, what she did, I don't care if the public thinks you're right, was low, cheap. God bless your ass. Yes, that was Nadia Mokami hapo. As you can see, she was a bit emotional. I think pregnancy, wako nataka to ajue. I think maybe it's in the early stages. So, wako nataka hiki tu nkama hii. To expose, but like I said in the previous video, I don't feel like what Jalango did was wrong because he's in the entertainment business, so Anafakonga Jua celebrities. So I think Nadia Mokami and Arrow Boy should have done a better job in hiding their pregnancy. Because I, th I think his situation yet in a little because so Nadia Juzi, Arrow Boy and Nadia Mokami, I think will come and like Tembele Jalango uko Kisumu. So I think up on the Jalango I'll the information. But anyway, tell me in the comment section, what do you think about the story? What do you think about the, this whole situation between Jalango, Nadia Mokami, and Aroboy? Do you think it was right for Jalango to reveal the fact that Aroboy and Nadia Mokami are expecting their first child? Tell me in the comment section and also remember to follow me on Instagram at jemomore.ke and I'll see you in the next one.